People around the world often think police are easy to trick if criminals pretend to be innocent. But they don't realize that all criminals act like this. Here's a similar case. A girl without a license was speeding and crashed into a man's car as he was driving home from work. She didn't even stop to check if he was okay. Let's find out what happens next. Uh, you okay, dude? You all right? Yeah. You injured? No, I'm okay. Yeah, it was a brown or beige Saturn black female driver, younger. I'm out with the other driver. He's advising so far no injuries, but there is airbag deployment, Maley and Caroline. You got, I've got rescue coming for you just to take a look at you and make sure you're okay, all right? You just getting off of work? Yeah. Heading home, huh? Yeah. Didn't even stop at the stop sign. Hit. Who? Did who, somebody else get hit? Yeah, he's good, I think. Did you get hit? Okay. You want to get out or you want to chill where you're at? It's up to you. I knew he just chill real quick. Yep, you're good. You're good, man. Take your time. Did you happen to take get a look at the driver of that vehicle at all? Yeah, I didn't think so. All I seen was a car not stopping. Direct to 81 Central. I've been switching to admin before. Is, the car registered? Is this car registered to you? It's your car? Yeah, it's okay. my car. Three X eighty one central. Yeah, All right, so real quick before uh, I get you your case number and everything, um, you want to press charges for the hit and run? Yeah. Okay, we have a female up the street detained that I'm going to go and identify because I saw her driving. If it's her, she's going to go to jail. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So just raise your right hand for me. You swear that everything in the statement you're about to give is true to the best of your ability. Yes, sir. And you understand that filing a false report in Florida is a criminal offense, and you can be charged for doing so. Yes. Okay. State your name and today's date. Juan Marty. Three. What was today? Uh, 4-1-22. Yep. And what happened today? I got in a hit. I got in an accident, hit and run. Okay. Did you see the vehicle? Yes. What color was the vehicle? Tannish brown. Did you see the driver at all? No. And did the vehicle stop and check on injuries? No. Did they attempt to exchange information with you or call the police no. for a report? Do you want to press charges for the hit and run? Yes. Perfect. Let me get you a case number and I'll get you out of here. The record will be here in just a second. Hey, uh, Russo's got one that's Dane. Apparently she admitted to being the driver. I'm going to go up there and take a look at her. If you just want to wait for Wrecker, I'm going to grab him his case number and then he's good. You driving this? Yeah, turn around and put your hands on your back. Yeah, well, just relax. Somebody just hit and ran. Somebody just hit. You just hit and ran somebody else. Yeah, you did. Sir, somebody hit me. Calm down. Let me call Tanya on the phone. 41 Central, 1012. Relax. 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 I asked her if she was driving. She said, yeah, somebody hit and ran her and she took off. Can I get up on the call, sister? Yeah. <laughs> this is not going to cause me. Female, there's a search. Oh, I 600 speedway. Somebody got to come and get me. <laughs> They'll come. Let me see your phone. Are you okay? Are you injured? Yeah. Uh, why did you flee the scene? I, because I was what scared, you what sir. You first? Talk to me real quick, all right? I'm sorry for, for doing that to you right now, but I have to put you in handcuffs. Okay. What's My name, name is Alexis. All right, Pardon listen me? to me real quick, all right? Alexis, you have the right to remain hey. silent. This Anything you say may be used evidence against you. You have the right to talk to an attorney or have him or her with you now or any time that question. If you cannot afford it, an attorney won't be appointed to represent you. If at any time you wish to stop talking or have an attorney present, I'll question him to stop your request. Do you understand your rights? Okay. Explain to me why you ran. Okay. Or why you I was away. coming out, so when I drove out, the police hit their lights. Okay. But when the police hit their lights, I kept, I mean, I kept going. But when I kept going, I already turned. Their lights were off. So me thinking they're trying to get around me, so I kept going. You feel me? I was scared. I know I have no license, so I got scared. I panicked. Okay. So I kept going. As I kept going, I did not hit them, sir. As me going, they was coming out and they bashed into the side of the car. You no. see, I didn't hit I can them. See that. I didn't hit them at all, sir. If I hit them, my front thing, their front thing would have been messed up. My whole side is messed up from the tire. Do you have ID on your purse? Yes. Can I grab it? Yes. Uh -huh. And I came here because I, the car was making a bad noise. You should have stopped. You're correct. But, like, will I get a bond? What? Will I get a bond? How much? Uh, I don't know what your charges are right now. You might have a, a fleeing charge. 
Come on, I'm gonna score for you. Relax, all right? It's an accident, okay? It'll be okay. You just do what you gotta do. Nothing in the car, guns, drugs, weapons, anything like that. Just be honest now, because we're gonna look through it. Do you have anything in there you're, scared, you're worried about? No. So, you saw the cop lights, and you got yeah, nervous because you didn't have a license? No, I saw the cop lights. I went out. As the police was coming in, it was ready to stop. I was already at a stop sign, so it's my goal. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right there by, um, right there by, you can go to Soul City. I'm straight. The police is coming to their stop sign. I'm already at the stop sign. It's okay. my goal to go. So, I went. The police hit the lights. I stopped. I kept going, but they turned their lights off. And I kept going. As I kept going, they were still behind me. They wasn't behind me. But then they flashed their lights again. I was already by the street where I got hit at. As me still going, it's no stop signs there. So as me still, no, it was, I stopped. And then I kept going. And then the white car was not supposed to come out as me going. So the white car hit me. And that's when I lost control of the car. And I grabbed the car back and pressed on the brakes. But then I would not be here right now. I would have hit the pole. So did I you got... make a complete stop at that stop sign before yes. you kept going? Yes, sir. You sure? Yes, I did. I made a complete stop sign at the stop sign. It was my goal to go. Okay. I don't see how. We're going to figure it out. Now, but I feel bad because she pulled in and she did tell us to call the police because somebody hit her okay. and she was scared. Okay. So, but I'm leaving now. So, she's going to be okay? No, she's going to jail. Because she fled from me before she crashed into somebody and then fled from the Your scene. Awesome. Lexi, just stop Positive ID. What you're okay, you almost crashed into me at South and Jean. Uh, when you pulled out in front of me on Caroline, okay? So I lit you up, you started to stop, and then you just took off. Then you blew the stop sign when you turned eastbound on Maley and crashed into that poor guy on his way home from work, and you kept on driving. Yes, you did. I watched it happen. When you don't stop at stop signs, it doesn't matter if he hits you, it's your fault. And you're required by Florida law to stop and make sure they're okay. Okay? If you would have just stopped, it never would have happened. I wasn't even going to write you a ticket. Okay, whether your license is valid or not, I don't have time for stuff like that. I would have addressed the violation and I would have sent you on your way. But you didn't stop, then you ran a stop sign and almost killed that guy. His car is total, and so is yours probably. Oil? Yeah. Whatever the hell that is. Do you have a, yeah, if you if you guys want to use your own tow company, I'm okay with that. Um, normally, if it's a hit and run, we tow it to our record because it gets held for the investigation. But... She's been identified as the driver because I watched I, I watched right. her. Do I, it, so. I just went out of town. I was going to see my granddaddy too. Uh, is it registered to you or it's registered to her? Uh, actually, it's registered by uh, mother wife. Okay. Uh, me, no driver's wife, license. Okay. Her own. But the car belongs to me. Okay, that's fine. I'm okay with that. Um, right. Just because you know she's been identified, there are no major injuries. Okay. I'll let you guys um, take it. What kind, of, what kind of bond are we looking at? Um, let's see. She's going to be charged with aggravated fleeing and eluding. Yes, sir. Uh, hit and run with injury oh and God. driving without a license. So right? her bond, the the DWLS is going to be 500. The hit and run with injury will be 5,000, and the aggravated fleeing and eluding will be five. So 10 grand. You know, right. about 1,500 bucks if you get a bondsman. 10%. You're not on probation for anything? No. You uh, what's your relation to her? That's my daughter. Okay. Do you want to take her property? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna check it real quick just to make sure there's nothing illegal in it because she is in custody and then I'll let you uh she almost killed that guy. His car is totaled. Oh his car. He almost killed me. No, you ran the stop sign. Okay. I understand that he hit your car, but you have to stop and yield to oncoming traffic. That you're crossing, the car? When you're crossing yeah, another you street, be, like, yeah, when you're crossing another street, you have to stop and wait for oncoming traffic. Not to mention, honestly, your, your biggest concern right now is the fleeing charge. Because had you not done that, the crash never would have happened. 
even if you stop at the stop sign. That's what's costing the, the most? The, the crash. The he wouldn't have would took you to jail for no license. I'm not going to take you to jail for driving with no license. Oh, you just would have had a ticket today. Go to court and you would have had to take a class. Possibly not even that. Yeah. I probably wouldn't even have written her a ticket for driving Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would just had her pull over. Y'all know Lydia, there's so much going on. Look at y'all happy yesterday. But when she I takes off. Ahead. But see, I didn't Literally. know all the rest of that. If she takes off and then but crashes into somebody. But I told you he's going to go to jail for no they're in, they're driving my hands with life. And he wants to press charges for the hit as well. So, like, wow. if for future reference, let's say you did stop at the stop sign. Let's say the fleeing, all that stuff, forget about all. Let's say you were just driving home, stop at a stop sign, somebody hits you. Even if it's their fault, if you take off, you're still going to get charged with it. You still have a duty in the state of Florida to stop and make sure that there's no injuries and extraction. Even if you're not at home. I'll get you some numbers. Give me a second. Can you unlock it? Thank you. And you had some money in your pocket, so I'm going to count it really quick. Can I get like $40 out of my purse from the girl right there? Do you want your purse to go with you? No, I just want money out of it. Okay. So I can pay for it. Well, this is all the money that you had in your pocket. So one, two, three, four. Yep, give me a second. And then you have... keep my phone and talk to Dave. I'll tell him what happened. What charge did you go to? The white one? Yes, the Air Jordan one. The Air Jordan one. So you have 429 and you want $40 out of your purse? In the end, she was arrested for aggravated fleeing and eluding, hit and run with injury, and driving without a license.